Hi, I'm Dr. Marty Klein, licensed marriage and family therapist and certified sex therapist. I'm a member of Empower.com's medical advisory board, and so they asked me to come in today and answer some of the many questions that we get to the site. And uh, right now, let's talk about pregnancy, because you can't talk about sex without talking about pregnancy, at least a little bit. Now, some people tonight, when they have sex, or tomorrow when they have sex, they want to get pregnant. And so they're going to do what they can to get pregnant. And that's great. But you know, 99% of the sex that people are going to have tonight around the world is not in order to create a pregnancy. It's for other reasons. It's to feel close. It's to have pleasure. It's to uh, get somebody off of your back who keeps complaining, why don't we ever have sex? It's to prove you're a real woman or a real man. People have sex for lots and lots and lots of reasons. Every once in a while, somebody has sex because they want to get pregnant. But most of the time, the overwhelming amount of time that people have sex, it's not because they want to get pregnant. And in fact, they hope that they won't. Well. Hope is not a good method, is it? So there are methods that you can use to prevent getting pregnant when you have sex. Now let's look at some of the questions that we get here because we have uh, readers, we have people on the net who want to know, can I get pregnant if I dry hump with my partner? Can I get pregnant if I have oral sex? Can I get pregnant if I kiss somebody? Can I get pregnant if I uh, deep kiss somebody? Can I get pregnant if somebody puts their finger in my butt? Can I get pregnant if somebody puts their finger in my vagina? Uh, now, you might want to ask, can I get pregnant if two different people put their finger in my vagina? Uh, can I get pregnant from this or this or that? Can I get pregnant if there's sperm all over my face? Can I get pregnant if there's sperm all over the wall, dripping down the wall? No, 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 no. You can't get pregnant if there's sperm flying all over the room if it is not inside your vagina. That is the only way that human beings can get pregnant. A bunch of sperm inside a vagina. Now there are a few different delivery systems for that sperm. The most common one is a penis. There are a couple of other delivery systems, mostly used in the medical profession. I suppose if you wanted to, if your partner ejaculates on your hand, you could scoop up the ejaculate and shove it up your vagina and kind of lay on your back, put your legs up in the air and hope for the best. Some people can get pregnant that way, mostly not. And yet, with all these ways that you can't get pregnant, people end up getting pregnant unintentionally. How does that happen? How does that happen? So let's remember that there are lots and lots and lots and lots of things that you can do sexually where you absolutely can't get pregnant. You can't get pregnant from oral sex. You can't get pregnant from a hand job, and so on and so on. What you can get pregnant from is a penis inside your vagina for two seconds. What you can get pregnant from is a penis inside your vagina even if you're standing up. What you can get pregnant from is a penis inside your vagina when you're really, really drunk. What you can get pregnant from is a penis inside your vagina when a person at the other end of the penis says, don't worry, I'll pull out really, really soon. You have nothing to worry about. Those are the ways that people get pregnant when they don't intend to. So if you want to get on top of your partner when you're both wearing your clothes and hump away, no problem. If you want to have lots and lots of oral sex, no problem. If you don't want to get pregnant when you have sex, there are ways to absolutely avoid that. And some of the things that you want to avoid are having a penis inside your vagina with no birth control, even just for a few seconds. That's the thing that you don't want to do. Now, if you want more information about birth control, there are websites all over the, all over the internet. And the good news is that they work, condoms work, condoms work almost every single time that you use them. They are a modern miracle. They're fantastic. If, if the people who founded this country uh, back in 1776, if they knew all the birth control options we would have today, they would be astounded and they would think these are medical miracles. So if you don't want to get pregnant, but you do want to have sex, go have sex, use one of these modern miracles, and then you have nothing to worry about. This is Dr. Marty Klein. If you have more questions about pregnancy or anything having to do with sex, go to empower.com ask, and we'll be happy to answer your question within 24 hours. How's that?